welcome back to my channel this is a message for Leo for October 5th till the 11th this is in regards to the full moon that we had October 1st so what were you able to release what are you resisting what's coming and then we have the final with the wisdom of the Oracle now thank you for subscribing if you're not a subscriber hit that subscribe button tap the bell leave me a comment and like share i greatly appreciate it remember these are general it may or may not apply if you like a personal reading with me my information is down below so let's see here what is coming on okay so we do have the nine of wands so uh, that is like you're coming to a surrender a release so let's see what is it that leo released here what is that? It's like, don't give up. There's a sense that you were giving up on something here. So the cards that have fallen out, or these cards have been so popular. We have, so I was asking, there's a sense of newness. This is in regards to really allowing the past to be the past. You, it was, It is actually completed. So this is really looking at, there was one more step in the journey for you to take. And this is telling me that, you know, in releasing the past did you need that one more step but it's telling me it's completed with the zero with the fool coming in and then we have the card of the star so there's a resistance here and also followed with the devil so you could also be dealing with a Capricorn here and this is in regards and also Aquarius so this is in regards to your life to the world the things that are shifting for you again you have a lot of major arcanas four major arcanas here and then I do have the card that also fell out with the world which is the meditation card and at the bottom of the deck we have the hangman so really shifting your perspective and seeing things in a new light Leo and this is talking about what are you resisting? You're resisting your own wishes, your own healing. There could be a healing that's needed between you and Capricorn, a release, a release of control, any toxicity, anything that has held you back, temptations, resistance, resistance to change. So there was, if there's been any issues between yourself and Capricorn, it's now it's asking you to resolve it, to heal it with the star card. So this is saying a healing that is saying don't resist the healing between yourself and this energy because it's toxic if you were to hang on to any toxicity and if this is in regards with a capricorn it is asking you not to resist the change and the healing because as you shift your perspective you're able to release that which has been holding you back and it's able to really give you the freedom and to complete the cycle of the world that you knew it's beginning it's another beginning this is the completion this is the final card so it's asking you to really cut the cord and allow yourself to heal if you felt there was something that is unresolved it is saying step into the new really you don't know what the new is but you've got the fool and the world so it's saying it's time for you to take you know take that first step even though if you don't know where this first step is going it is asking you to be like the baby chick and to trust your journey by healing your past or healing something with a capricorn anything that has been blocking you any toxic behavior by shifting your energy and really going within through silence and meditation and opening up that third eye and really seeing your world as something new this is about becoming very conscious and acceptance of the past because there's healing here so allow the healing to really happen with the wisdom of the oracle that's the card that wanted to come out i love this card it's between worlds so yeah this is like being stuck in the past and then stepping into the new direction and three that's the the spirit card and it's really asking you to step into something new this is transitioning from one life like i said um, out of one situation and then going into another but with this card it is saying it's time for you from zero to this to complete it don't get stuck here this is being stuck between the old and the new in this energy with the devil there's a sense of you feeling like you are stuck but you're not stuck it's making that a choice and maybe you're temporarily blinded by the way you've been looking at things but it's asking you to really shift things it's a time for you to see things in a different way in a different light and for you really to step forward into this transitioning because you're being asked to change an old way of thinking, an old way of knowing, an old way of being within the past and really see things in a different way so you can have new relationships not based on any um, codependency or stagnation or toxicity or control but that you have healed it and you've shifted perspective and now your world is shifting because you took a time out for yourself. This week, I'm sending you love and light. Until next week, namaste.